Hello, hi, welcome to a new vlog. So this is the coolest show in the history of television. Yeah, yeah, it's like, it's like, it's the coolest show in the history of television. Yeah. This is stupid. Bunch of dumbasses. Yeah, yeah, stupid. It's like, just a bunch of dumbasses. So today is day three of a new lifestyle and day three of no takeout. So I am a addict to food and I am going to stay away from the foods that I am addicted to. I'm an, I was going to say like, hopefully I'm successful today, but I already know I'm going to be because I just, I don't care. I don't care. And continue nourishing my body with foods that make me feel good. So like fasting for 16 hours feels amazing. I know that I can have my water and I just feel good. I haven't felt like super physical hungry. I have felt like mental hungry, which fasting app I can eat in about 30 minutes. So I fasted for 15 minutes and 33 seconds and it just feels really good. Um, I am weighing myself daily because I just want to see like how my body is. And I'm going to share my weigh-ins with you guys like weekly. And right now I'm not liking it very much either because I have been measuring every single thing that goes in my mouth. That's what she said. <laughs> Michael. Michael. Uh, yesterday, I had 1800 calories so the day before that I had 1600 and I am drinking water I'm peeing more I'm moving more I'm exercising more and I'm doing more I'm doing better I'm eating like extremely healthy and especially compared to like how I used to eat and I haven't lost any weight I've actually gained <laughs> you cannot be for real oh my god you for real no you for fake no you for real <laughs> I have gained actually like I don't even want to say it out loud you lying you not. <gasps> I've gained 0.6 of a pound, but it is confusing to me, especially because like water weight comes off of me really easily usually because I hold on to so much. So that's a 3.6 gain and I know exactly what caused that. I have been drinking tons of water. I noticed for the rest of the night, I'll barely pee. That means I'm holding on to all this water. I'm not giving excuses, hey. So it's like the fact that I'm not even losing water weight is frustrating because like, minus that i just feel better i feel lighter um my lymphedema feels a little bit looser i mean towards the end of the night it does get super hard which is understandable because i'm up more moving more exercising etc i can't let daily fluctuations mess with me i have to really focus in more on like the weekly aspects because i know a lot of people don't believe in daily weigh-ins so we're just not even going to include those a few moments later all right you guys so i am about to break my fast it's been 16 hours and 36 minutes. Ooh, I said it was the fifth time I've done this, but that's only because I had this app like a year ago or more. 12 seconds later. So this is filled with freaking veggies. It's insane. Let's start with what I haven't tried. I haven't done mustard and cottage cheese inside of celery, but I'm about to try it now. So good. And another one I haven't done for you guys is the radish. <laughs> oh my God. Game changer. So what else I have? is a brussels sprout everything is raw by the way which just feels so good on my body i'm dead sexy look at my sexy body oh. i just literally had to pause the video and chew that brussels sprout it took like literally a solid two minutes now we also have some broccoli and we have some asparagus i hate cooked asparagus i don't think i've ever had it in my life where i liked it but i like it raw baby, I like it raw. Yeah, baby, I like it raw. cauliflower we have some carrots. I also have some green olives with uh, garlic in the middle. That slaps. Oh, slap, slap, slap you. <laughs> I'm going slap, slap, happy. Slap, buddy, slap. There's a slap for you. Slap, slap, slap. Apple. Chicken sausage. And by the way, if you guys want to keep your... We also have strawberry. Mm. Fruits, like, alive and well for longer. Put it in the fridge. And if you don't know, now you know. And for someone that has a bigger stomach, aka me, like I want more food, obviously, to feel satiated. So, so I'm gonna continue this meal. And I just noticed that this just keeps me full forever. And it just feels good. All right, you guys. So this is my finished plate. I'm as full as a tick on a dog. A tick on a slow moving hound dog. <laughs> Two hours later. So I had an air fryer for a couple of years, and it was actually recalled. Okay, I'm so excited. The first thing did already unbox it. The rest of the stuff we are unboxing together. But I got an air fryer 
so excited um me and my ex did have an air fryer but i personally didn't like that one and i know that she did and i remember every time i would use it like my food would taste like plastic but it turns out totally not normal and it was recalled so i got a new one because this is actually the brand from my most favorite freaking celebrity one That was so dangerous. Been a favorite since I was literally knee high to a grasshopper. Like, so what I'm trying to say is it's Drew Barrymore. Hi, Drew Barrymore. Let's open her up. Are you doing a reveal for me? Yeah, I'm doing a reveal for you. Do you want to help me get it out? Big meaty claws. The brand is literally called Beautiful, by the way. <laughs> oh, I'm trying to get it out of the box. Oh, okay. Big meaty Claws. So here it is. Beautiful. So here's a little booklet. You can also get it in black. I got the white one. Oh, she's heavy. Oh my gosh, look at her. And I'm so excited to use her. Feline's taken off some of the stickers. And also, um, it is touchscreen. So all of this stuff is gonna be right here once it's like turned on and stuff. I don't know if I want to keep her on the counter at all times because it is kind of bulky. I will say it smells like plastic, but and there she is. It's so cute and beautiful, literally. Later. So regarding the air fryer, I have decided to just like keep it in a cabinet till I want to use it because it is pretty big and bulky. I'm so excited. Like I love air fried foods, but you guys, I'm cleaning my uh, bathroom. I have two more perfumes that are empty. It is Kardashian perfumes. I'm gonna use a perfume type of girly. I was trying to cover up the smell of the- Like I love to smell good. I know a lot of people like to correlate bigger people with smelling bad. It's kind of gross. It's fat shaming. Shame you're a big fat liar. But um, also this perfume I got from Pink Sparkles. We are almost halfway done with it. It's Kenzie Buttercup Babe. And then the one I'm really loving as well is Versace Bright Crystal. Versace? You can't even spell Versace. Versace. Versace, Versace, Medusa head on me like I'm Numenati. I like a little bit of Do you see what Do I you see? see what I see? Any Kardashians? I think I'm over their perfume um i do like this one which is also a kardashian one so this might be the only one when it's empty that i might actually repurchase 20 minutes later so right now i am cooking my next meal i am making brussels sprouts with some colorful potatoes there's like purple yellow white I got my seafood boil um her pizza <laughs> went all over the floor it, it was honestly terrifying if she wasn't there i would have died so she started beating on my back like beating and thankfully by doing that i think it dislodged and i ended up puking out the like it was like a potato this big okay so now i got the steak cut up i'm gonna season it a bit and then add some minced garlic so now i have everything cooking together i added some sriracha a little bit of soy sauce and now i'm gonna put a lid and let it cook a bit okay my food is complete i was just really craving a potato Stupid is, stupid does, sir. So I tried to figure out how to make it healthy. And by the way, when you guys hear this noise, that's the refrigerator. It's not a fart. <laughs> this would be so good on top of some rice, but so I'm gonna pass on that. One minute, 37 seconds later. Reality is I could have died that day and that's a crazy way to go. <laughs> Choking on a potato. <laughs> I wanna try the steak first. There's a little bit of brussel. Mm. That's good. I also added some red pepper flakes. It like adds spice without flavor. All right, are the potatoes cooked? <laughs> Joe, Joe, mm -hmm. Joe, oh, Joe. Perfect. Wait, this is like the best thing I've made in a while. It's like a stir fry in a weird way. <laughs> and I was just like thinking like, I've been showing a lot of my food and I know I've said in the past that like, showing my food and like what people say about my food is triggering. But I realized that like, when I know that I'm on track and I'm doing right, I don't care what people say. And one minute I care and one minute I don't. I don't care what people say. I don't, so. Huh. A lot of boring math later. Baby. Baby. So we're about to watch Krampus, because it's Christmas time. <laughs> Krampus, bitch. I'm <laughs> just kidding. Um, it is Vlogmas in June. Oh, I look rough. Wait, let me fix my hair. <laughs> oh, what the fuck was that? <laughs> what is happening? <laughs> So we're about to watch Krampus because we were like thinking of a movie to watch and we didn't know so I've been talking about Krampus I want Feline to see it and see if she's so scared of the gingerbread <laughs> Oh, I don't know Um, so I'm gonna have a little snack I'm gonna have a couple of these spicy dill pickle almonds and Oh my baby And um 
Twinkies part of our little movie night date night. I am feeling a little triggered. Like this is a moment where I would want to order food and just feel good with takeout. So I'm not going to do that. Okay, so Feline fell asleep during our movie, but um, H3 is like doing a live show. I wish I was there. So I've only been watching this live from H3 for like 30 minutes. I just love them so much. I don't know what it is. I'm about to have my last meal of the night. Um, I can still eat for another two hours. This is what I chose for my last meal. We have some olives with some garlic, strawberries, a mandarin. This is a breakfast sandwich with just egg whites and some turkey sausage. I always put tapatio on my breakfast sandwich because without it, it's just not the same. No, that's a 10 out of 10. But I'm here to end the vlog. I hope that you guys enjoyed it and I'll see you in my next one. Bye. Ask the question, then you said it. I was saying things you're regretting. Can't erase the steps we're taking. Can't go back. To the time and place we met